Hi, everybody. I'm Donna Frasca from DecoratingByDonna.com, and welcome to today's Color Quickie. <laughs> All right. Um, today is January 4th, 2021, so Happy New Year, everybody. And again, welcome to this um, a, a, about a 10-minute Color Quickie. I really want to promote more of these because they're super fun and usually only about 10 minutes long. All right, today I wanted to talk about um, a neutral color, which is unusual for me. Uh, it is Seashell by Benjamin Moore. Now you can see it uh, barely right here. Now you can't really see it that well. Um, it's really, we can see it a little bit better there. It's really light, but look at it up. It's a Seashell OC-120 by Benjamin Moore. It's kind of crazy that I'm excited about a beige because, you know, if you've been looking at my videos in, in my, my uh, dot com, see that I'm really not a beige girl. However, I'm really excited about seashell because my friend painted her house, the entire first floor, what's a ranch, in seashell and it looks amazing. Yes, I suggested this color for her. <laughs> so um, she trusted my decision, my color choice. Now what she had before in her dining room and um, kitchen was a green. Her dining room, it was similar to like a sagey, cross between like a pea green and a sage green. And she had an accent wall, you know, darker green. It was really pretty because it was kind of was similar to, I want to say, country style home, perhaps. And in her kitchen, she had the tile, the backsplash, it had the green in it. It looked really pretty, very cozy. And you know, I love green. Uh, green is uh, my favorite color because it's about the heart chakra. I <laughs> love it. Um, so recently, she wanted to paint her house because as we are, as we have left 2020 behind, so many people are painting their home, uplifting lighter and brighter colors, um, you know, such as seashell. And man, what a difference does it, does it make? Um, I will be posting before and after pictures on decoratingbydonna.com. So please be sure to take a look. I'll be working on that this week. So hopefully that'll, that'll be up and running soon. But, but here again, um, it's just, um, you know, the colors that I see people change, you know, using for their homes now um, as early into 2021 as we are. Uh, so many people are saying, oh, I want to redecorate. I'm moving things around. And I talked about this before. It's a good thing to do. Uh, but again, just choose the colors that you love. And I do recommend choosing a nice color, an uplifting color and, and saturated, yummy, happy colors. And, you know, guys, gray, Please do not use gray. You know, it's, 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 I'm sorry, but it's the color of death to me. And, and I've had clients say, Donna, please help me get rid of, I, I chose gray for my house and it feels depressing, but I'm happy to say that um, the clients, the virtual clients that I've been working with, um, you know, they, they're, they're getting gray out of their house and they're choosing, you know, light neutrals or, you know, pretty saturated colors, even yellow, which is, which is kind of uh, surprising because yellow is a hard sell, yellow, pale yellow. I'm not talking, you know, big bird yellow, but um, it's, it's very interesting the way these color trends are gravitating towards. All right, so um, here again, today's color quickie is about Seashell by Benjamin Moore, OC-120. Go take a look at it on the Benjamin Moore website, really, pretty neutral. If I had to sell my home or someday if I do sell my home, um, that's more than likely the color that I'll choose to neutralize, uh, you know, my home. No gray ever, but a nice creamy beige, you know, it's, it's more than beige. It's, it's like a, a pretty buttercream color is what it is. So go take a look at it and, you know, give me a few days. Today's January 4th. 2021. Give me a few days to upload um, those before and after pictures of uh, my friend's house that she just painted on the inside. And uh, she got rid of the greens, you know, that I just showed you. And even in her living room was a gray. And every time I went over there, did it look pretty? Yeah, 
It did, but it just didn't feel right. And the gray next to the green didn't, didn't work. So I'm so happy that my friend took my color advice and she, um, she painted her house um, the, uh, the, the beige, uh, the seashell, seashell OC 120. So go ahead and take a look. And again, I hope you enjoyed today's color quickie. All right, bye-bye.